All right, guys, the big day has arrived. I need to shave. Movers are here. We're starting to move things out. We got Lut Lut. We got Sheila helping out. We got Hannah Gray's. Uh, but yeah, everything is packed up. Big things are ready to go. Let me step outside. I'll show you the big truck we got rented. It's a really big truck. Maybe overkill, but I'd rather have overkill than uh, packing everything in so tight. But here's the truck. Right here. Actually, there's three guys. That is the truck right there. It's a big truck. Definitely can get all our stuff in there. But anyways, these guys are doing all the work. <laughs> I mean, they're young. Well, they're not all that young, but they do this for a living, so. Look, look, cleaning up as we go. Uh, the small one, like foods and everything. Are we going to put that in the car? We oh, can put that in the car, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put that stuff in the car. What? It is moving day. We are excited. There's a nice apartment here. But. We're moving to a bigger, better apartment. Anything to say, Lut? Hmm? Anything to say? Um, we're excited. We're excited. Yeah, excited and it's gonna be a top day today because I do a lot of things and... Yeah, Lut was already at the market this morning. She went to the market and uh, got a bunch of groceries and stuff and... So she's been up early. Me and Hannah Grace, we slept in for a little while. <laughs> Anything to say, Hannah Grace? No. No, then, <laughs> she, uh, I tried to wake her up, but she won't. Yeah. She's okay. Okay. Oh. All right, guys, it is moving day. All right, guys, everything is out. That's for our stove and washer wise, our little wash area. Another thing I would do is uh, suggest somebody, or suggest that when you leave a place, make sure you videotape everything or photograph everything to make sure they don't come back later and say, oh, the toilet was broke or whatever. But everything is emptied out of the apartment. Just my bags, sweep, broom, dustpan. Oh yeah, it is empty. Everything is out. Head upstairs. Got a little bit of water from the air conditioner. But uh, everything is empty. Bedroom's empty. All your windows are intact. Nothing's busted. Floors are okay. Nothing's smashed up out of the floors. Cabinets are all working. Everything's good. The other toilet, the other bathroom. We even left the curtain, shower curtain for them. <laughs> and then uh, Hannah Grace's room. Everything's still intact, all the windows, nothing's busted. Floors are all intact, cabinet doors are all intact. But yeah, I would definitely go through like I'm doing, film or photograph everything so Landlord cannot come back later and say you broke stuff. Now our landlord's actually out of town and uh, I gotta get with him when he gets back and uh, but everything is good to go. You can just take that whole thing like that. T don't unscrew it. Take, take the whole thing. Wires and all. But that is it. I'll show you the truck all packed up. I'll be back in. Surprisingly, they used all the space. If it can fit in the car, put it in the car. Yeah. 
my fridge. But everything is loaded, and they used every space of it. So I guess it was an overkill once everything got in there. And our trunk is full in the car, so we are Hannah Grace is saying goodbye to Jackie, her best. There's her Bess up there. She's doing laundry. <laughs> but yeah, we're good to go. There's old Meow Meow. Meow Meow's getting a drink. Meow Meow was a good cat. But the cat comes with the property, so. But uh, that's it, guys. We are wrapping this one up here in our apartment. If anybody is in Angeles City and they're looking for a place, send me an email or contact me through uh, Philly in the Philippine Facebook page and uh, if you're interested in this place, it's 12,000 a month unfurnished uh, Which For the area, I, I guess it's okay. But anyways On to the new apartment All right guys everything has been moved into the new apartment now um, as you can see now it's time to unpack and uh, Get things situated Got load out in the kitchen with Sheila they're unpacking the kitchen stuff. Got everything in. Everything is good. Got Anna Grace. She's excited. Um, but we do have a little issue. Um, and when they loaded everything up, I gave them a thousand pesos. It's two thousand seven hundred to move everything. All right. In the process of moving, they managed to break my desk. They lift it up on the one end here and on the other end there, and uh, they broke it. They they busted it out, and um, it needs fixed, or it needs repaired, or it needs replaced. But now you tell me, guys, am I right or am I wrong? I told him, listen, there's a balance, but I'm not going to pay it until this table gets fixed or it gets replaced. I told them, contact the owner of the company, and I'll talk to the owner and we'll come to a decision but i'm not handing them the remainder of the balance and then them take off and then i don't hear from them again um, so am i right or am i wrong i feel i'm right i mean it worked and it wasn't broke when they moved it so but anyways everything is moved in now we're uh, just unpacking and uh that's how the day's rolling all right so we have come to an agreement on the table on the uh the desk um, you know what? Yeah, it's not the most expensive desk. It's not the cheapest desk. But you know what? It was in perfect condition before they moved it. Um, but we came to an agreement. Um, they put some support brackets in it. Of course, you know, I wasn't going to get a new desk out of it. It would be more than what, uh, <laughs> what I paid for the moving guys. But, yeah, you got it. You know, I don't care where you're at. United States, Germany, wherever. you got to check your stuff. Um, after it's moved because if you don't and they break stuff um, they'll just walk away from it and I was not going to let them just walk away from this I wanted it fixed so we came to agreement they fixed it and everything is good to go now so anyways it is moving right along everything is coming together I'm not going to show you yet I'll wait till everything is put away and I still gotta I gotta get down I gotta get a drill um, Gotta hang some shelves out in the garage area and just different things that I need to drill for. And uh, so I, had to, I gotta do that. Not ain't gonna be today or anything. Uh, it'll probably be tomorrow sometime. But anyways, things are moving right along. And uh, once everything is situated, I'll give you a tour of the apartment and what it looks like. All right, guys, we are up and we are running. Turn on later. Everything, eh, I'd say about 90% of stuff is up, unboxed and uh, up on, you know, display and got everything up. Uh, cable came today, so we have the cable hooked up. We have the internet hooked up. Uh, like I said, there's the table or the desk. They fixed it. We're good to go. Uh, but you know what? This place is definitely a lot bigger. A lot bigger than our other apartment um, once we got everything in here uh, I told Lud, I said man I felt like I was living in like a hang on let me turn this light on so you guys can see 
I told Lou, I said, man, I felt like I was living in a box. I mean, it was, it was just small. But yeah, everything fit in here. There's a lot of room still. Um, you know, it, it's nice here. It's bigger, it's deeper. There's Lou's kitchen. Let me turn on the light quick. There's Lutz wet kitchen. Like I said, not everything is 100% put away. We are going to get another shelf table or a yeah, shelf like this one here and stick over here because she needs more shelving. You know, the one thing is the apartment that we were in, a lot of cabinet space for the kitchen. But you know what? I'll give up cabinet space for this bigger wet kitchen. Um, but yeah, there's laundry area. I guess we got to do some laundry tossed all the boxes out here we still got to clean that up but yeah I mean it's definitely definitely a lot bigger feels I don't know feels good you know I'll take a stroll up the steps here uh, it is hot show you of course the bathroom I mean you guys have seen all this it's just us moved in now kind of Grace's room it's not very big but you know what it's big enough for her and 99% of the time she sleeps in the bedroom anyways she drags her mattress in and lays it on the floor and sleeps uh, you know the CR or the bathroom whatever you want to call it got the hot water heater up there I actually got to fix that Water pressure here upstairs is terrible, but I'll give up that for a bigger place. And I got the air conditioning going on in the bedroom. So yeah, we got the air conditioning going on in here. I turned it on to cool the room off. Problem is, the hole's bigger than the air conditioner. Now I'm checking to see if this is gonna cool this room down or if I have to get a bigger air conditioning or a bigger air conditioner. Um, seems to be nice and cool in here right now. So anyways, that's it guys. We are moved in. Everything is 100% here and uh, it's time for me to take a shower and look ran over to the store real quick. And let's see, she's got laundry over there at one of the laundry places so she's picking that up but she's grabbing a few things and feeding liberty but anyways guys you know what i won't bore you anymore with the apartment we're moved in uh you guys have been waiting for this and you know you've been following this journey with us and this move with us so anyways guys uh tomorrow i got a few more things to do i gotta get to the hardware store i gotta get a drill i want a drill uh, and I gotta get some shelves. I wanna put some shelving out in the garage, put the motorcycle helmets and just different things I need to get. So anyways, guys, uh, tomorrow's another day and the journey continues.